the nice thing is that if we went back five years ago, we would be in a really huge, painful situation because we would be back in the old days of marketing mix modeling, where we would have to collect a ton of data, like three years worth of data. And the output of that data would only be at the channel level. So if you were a search marketer, all you would know is if your budget went up or went down, there wouldn't be any insight into what keyword or campaign is actually doing better or worse. Now, because of the advances of machine learning and AI, it's a whole different world. We're actually going to end up with the same exact output that we had with multi-touch attribution. When we used to put up tags and we used to collect all of this user level data, the output is the same, but we now have a little extra added benefit. It used to be that with multi-touch attribution, we had a report that told us what happened yesterday, how things look. And then as a marketer, my job is in to make a decision on where to invest those dollars based upon how past performance. And that's typically how we do it as marketers. Okay, these guys, this combination of things look good. I'm going to increase that budget 10% and then I'm going to monitor it every day. Well, AI can help us do that a lot better. With AI, we can say, hey, next month, my budget is going to be exactly the same. But what I want you to do is I want you to run through millions of possible simulation to figure out where I could put the dollars based upon what just happened. So we're letting AI do all of the work to actually come up with the optimum media plan for us. Now, that doesn't mean that we don't expect that marketers are going to change everything and do it word for word. But what it does is, as a marketer, it lets you sit back, take some of the stress off, and then be able to make a decision. Okay, this, these look like good bets. I'm going to do these three out of five things. So what we're able to do now, the advantage is we're going to let the machines do the heavy lifting because us marketers, we've never been really good at math anyway. So let the machines do it. 